So I thought I'd share a little video of my recent injury. Um, I think a video is better than you seeing close-up pictures of my injured nose. Um, but this time last week, I had my last surf of the holiday and came in on the beach and I don't know what happened, but I got terribly dumped as I <laughs> landed on the beach and my board hit my nose and I just felt my whole nose clunking out of, it felt like the whole thing shifted out of place and kind of back in. And so the first thing was, oh, sure, but I've broken my nose. The next thing was like, oh, pray no one saw that. And I came out and my son, William, and his friend were on the beach laughing at me because it was looked so disastrous. And the next thing, they just, their eyes grew big as blood gushed down my nose. Um, and it was sort of swelling already. And um, shame, they were very sweet and carried my board and I felt like I should not be doing this, trying to learn to surf at my age. Um, anyway, I put some ice on it and as soon as I got home, I put some helichrysum into the, into the wound and it stopped bleeding and it sort of scabbed up quite quickly. And then I put deep blue on neat um, quite often during the day and just dabbing it on and around and then I repeated that, yeah, about five or six times that first, the first two days. I mean, the first morning I woke up, it was all very swollen and puffy and, but thankfully not terribly bruised. I thought I was going to have black eyes and that this whole thing was going to be looking hideous, but I had a scab and this puffiness. And within two days, that puffiness had gone right down and I just had the scab and it sort of scabbed over and I used Immortel all around the area and also on my nose. And that was a week ago and now I'll do a little bit of a close-up you can sort of see a tiny bit of my nose there and I'm still using Immortel but the helichrysum and the uh, deep blue if I hadn't had helichrysum I would have used lavender and frankincense on it um, but helichrysum is a game changer it's called liquid stitches for good reason it's amazing for any wounds and so using that and the deep blue um, and the Immortel has been amazing and now I'll just continue with using the Immortel on my nose until that little war wound disappears. So I just want to share my story. Also I've been using the same, the Helichrysum and Immortel and my son had terrible chafes for his, um, his um, wetsuit and he, we just dabbed some Helichrysum on there and it made an enormous difference. And our daughter for her roasty that she got um, playing hockey on the Astro. We've been using the skin spray and some drops of um, helichrysum have been amazing to get it to scab over. And then we've just used um, oregano roller or tea tree roller or our flute roller around the area just to give it sort of antiviral, antibacterial effects. And then as it heals over, we'll use the Immortel to help it with healing. So I just thought I'd share some of our family's war wounds and um, our stories of healing with our oils, which I'm so grateful for. I, I couldn't face going back to school and work and everything with this huge bulbous nose. And thank goodness the oils healed it so incredibly quickly.